Will the House come to order? Mr. Clerk. Aloha and good morning. Today's invocation will be delivered by Representative Lauren K. Alohilani Matsumoto. Will the members who wish to participate please rise? Aloha and good morning. <laughs> it's my honor to stand before you all today and to serve alongside each and every one of you. As many of you know, I'm coming up on my first full year as a legislator in our great state of Hawaii. Throughout this last year, we've had many individuals stand before us and talk about working together, putting differences aside, and representing our state. All too often, these words of wisdom seem to too is easily slip away. As we continue on through this special session, I humbly ask each and every one of you to take a step back, to put aside our titles, our leadership positions, our parties, and remember that we are people, serving our people. The name on my birth certificate is not representative. My name is Lauren. The word representative is not our name or even our title. It is our job description. We are each given the honor and privilege to represent our districts. As we head into the House committee hearing tomorrow, I challenge you to think about this privilege that we all hold. We all know that it is gonna be a long and tiring process. And I encourage all of us to remember that whether it's the first person or the 5,000th that has come before us, to each person sitting before you, it is their one and only chance to have their thoughts be heard, and quite possibly the first, first time to ever testify at our state capitol. So when the hours grow late and the bodies get tired, let us remember that we are here to serve, and it is our job description to listen and represent the people of our state. With that, let's, let us bow our heads. Heavenly Father, thank you so much for the privilege you have given us to be representatives of our beautiful state. I pray that as we continue on through this week, that you give us the wisdom and discernment to do your will, that we approach this issue with an open mind and an open heart and with a loving spirit. Grant us the faith and courage to serve the people of Hawaii in all that we say and do. In your name we pray, amen. 